Let's talk now about the teams themselves. A Michelin team is known as a an Onava. Um, there's 12 players on a team and they um, are all on the field simultaneously and from the beginning of the game. It's not like other games where there's substitutions. This game is you bring everybody to the match and everyone starts on the field. Uh, if somebody's late for a match then you're definitely at a disadvantage in the game of Michelin um, because the whole object one of the objects of the game is to try to eliminate the other team and the less people you have there it's to your it's a considerable disadvantage so it's not illegal to go on the field with less than your team but um, you can definitely be hurt by people not showing up or being people thrown getting thrown out of the game and so on um, in addition you can't have more than 12 players dressed for a match that's obvious um, you can have substitute players but they will not be able to play in said match and um, like I said you can show up with as many players as you want but if you happen to show up with four players you're gonna have to forfeit the match it's just the rules of the game so um, the team's called an Onava and there's 12 players and you know the rules for that um, in addition each team consists of one player or captain of the team known as a Duxa. Um, he makes all the on-field decisions. However, if this player is off the field, then he really can't speak for his team if he's been eliminated or thrown out of a match, which is the reason why each team must assign two Alteras, um, which are basically assistant captains of the team and whoever's on the field at the time is going to have to take charge. Uh, in, in between plays, in between games, yes, the Dukes can speak, but if the Dukes is thrown out of the match, like I said, he can't speak for his team. 